Hello everyone, Bridget here. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, please take a quick second and hit that subscribe button down below and the gray bell to be notified when I upload a video. Right now we're looking at my available paintings that are varnished. I will go through them one by one. These are all 8 by 10s $10 a piece plus shipping. So wherever you live, you still have to pay whatever the shipping is plus ten dollars um, these are discounted canvases paintings as some of them have a little something wrong with them I mean these were all my beginners um, I do have a little a couple more that I have to varnish these were from 2018 so there's like I mean I was learning so there may be something a little wrong with them and whatnot so I'm going to try to go through these as best as I can. And these are numbered. These are um, also put on Instagram, so, and I've already sold a couple. So, like, we're starting off with number two for this one. Let's see if we can bring it up. Um, this one really does not have anything wrong with it except for the sides. I could probably um, sand the sides down. I think I may do that and varnish it again. But $10 for that. Um, so that was number two. This is number three. Number three. Um... I do know it was like a bottle bottom pour with some blues, a green, purple, like a Caribbean color, metallic silver. Um, not sure what all would be wrong with this except for the side here. Did not get all covered when it was tilted. Again, like I said, this is why these are $10, guys. So, they usually run, I don't know, $15, $20, depending on um, what paint you use and whatnot. This is number four. Um, what This one was actually poured over another painting. I spray painted the older painting, and that is why we're seeing all of this but I really like how the darkness is coming out on the edges I think the only thing that's really wrong with this is right here other than that um, this one's not bad at all just an ugly back but I'm not fixing those I will be um, working on making my 2019 paintings better alright that was number four I'm hanging them up as I'm doing this so they may be crooked up there, hello. This is number five. I do know number five has this little lump here, but it was pretty. It's another bottle, bottom pour. With all kinds of like blue, yellow, some copper. There's some cells going on here. Really cool. Um I think that was the only spot right there. But other than that, this one turned out pretty good. Okay. Now one of my favorite ones is number six here. Number six. Uh, this was a balloon explosion. I put paint in the balloon. I popped it over a wet surface. And this is what it looked like. This one's kind of... It's got some effects to it, but I really like it, so I did not change it. This was also like a paint over a painting. So, yes. But I really like this one. Um, this one, everybody commented like, oh, I see a donkey, I see a fish, I see a dog. There's all kinds of different things you see in this. Um. So if you're interested, that's number six. Uh, number seven here was a strainer pour. I really don't know. 
as I'm looking at it, I really can't tell if there's really anything wrong with it. Oh, there is one little spot in the middle. I don't know if you can see it. But I really like the colors. So I kept it like this. Trying to get a good angle of what it looks like. These are all sealed and varnished with uh, polyacrylic. So this is number eight. This was like a flip and drag. Blow it around with a straw or something. Cool colors. Um, I think I would actually hang it up like this. But I have it on my wall going like this so I have room and they're all the same way. But that's number eight. Um, I don't know if this one really has anything wrong with it. So, yeah. Number nine is another favorite. This was a flip cup. I think it was actually two flip cups on the black surface uh, base. Um, like a cup was here, a cup was here. And um, I really like all the cells going on here. This here kind of looks like a polar bear kind of thing in my eyes. But hey, um, this one, I don't know if there was anything wrong with it. But I was just doing all my 2018 paintings uh, for $10, so it was easy. Number 10 was a flip cup. Really cool. Um, the, bat, the side here didn't get covered in this corner. And I think that was all on this one. I'm trying to figure out a better way to record all these guys. So hang that one up. Here's number 13. I love the colors. Um, this one would probably be perfect. Except for while it was drying. I thought it was totally dry. And I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Um, right here is a fingerprint. Because I thought it was dry and I went to touch it. And now whoever gets it has my fingerprint. Here's number 14. Folly looking. Pretty. Hang that up. Number 15 was... I Forever, I could not figure out how I did this. It was one of the spice container pours with like the pastel -y colors. This one here did not get covered on the edge, but it gave it some look, some cool effects. So it's got like the purples, blues, some green, like a lime green. Oh, I think there's some copper in it. Pink. My goal for 2019 is to um, keep track of what is being poured on, too. On, like, a sticky note and put it in the back. Here is a lot of people's favorites. Um, number 16. This one here. Um, the side did not get covered up. Which I should probably have fixed it before I varnished it. There's a little dot here and here. Other than that, I really like this. A lot of people like it. You know, within a matter of 24 hours, not even 24 hours of posting uh, paintings on Instagram, I sold four of them. This one was originally sold spoken for but the person that wanted this one decided to get a different one which was totally fine with me but this was a swipe this one is actually i don't think it's too bad um so i i really don't know what was wrong with this one this is number 17 um this was um Let's see, I think I did a total of five swipes, and that is the only one I kept. Alright guys, so these are 
the paintings that are available right now. I do have more. I am trying to um, varnish and I will have them posted. I do have some bigger ones like this one here and that one there. I have not. I still have one more coat of varnish to do on them. I have another one. I have a couple of them, so yes, um, that are not 8 by 10s that are going to be a little more. But we're going to go through these real quick. Number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, and 17. If any of you are interested, please email me. Uh, leave a comment down below. I prefer email or DM me on Instagram. Um, I do have Facebook now. Uh, all the links to all of that is down below. So if you want to... Uh, follow my Facebook, which I don't have much of the artwork on there yet. I want to start a business page kind of thing. So, um, I just started Facebook. I'm learning still. So, that'll take me a little bit of time. But, uh, again, these are $10 plus shipping. Um, I don't care. Just uh, message me. And we can go from there. It is PayPal. Um, I find it hard to receive money through the PayPal link of, like, after I send an invoice. I'm still struggling trying to receive the money that was sent. It keeps on saying it's pending and whatnot. So I do have a link where you can just, like, an auto pay and it comes straight to me so I can use that money to ship it out. So, um, in the process, I will figure all that out. But right now, it is PayPal. But if you have any questions, please feel free to ask me. Email me or DM me on Instagram, please, and thank you. Again, my email address is down below. My Instagram is down below. My Facebook link is down below. There's a PayPal link down below. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. And if you guys enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to hit the bell, and also in the description box, I will put down, like, painting number two, three, and so on, and once they sell, I will put in cap locks that they have been sold right next to it, so please check the description box if you're interested in these paintings. Again, thanks for watching. Sorry for a long video. We'll see you all next time. Bye.